This is how you know Gatlinburg's back to being not busy. <laughs> what are you chasing, Red? I ain't sure yet, but it could be tasty, so it's worth a go. <laughs> Man, they were fighting whatever they were. Yeah. They didn't like each other. Lord, I'm hung up in there. <laughs> Hold on, what are these here? What are we looking at? I, I guarantee you, I can tell you, by his hole right there, that's a saber tooth cliff rat, son. Saber tooth cliff a rat. Saber tooth cliff. That's what I call them. They're big as a possum. All right. Putting their foot and a half long. Uh oh. He'll <laughs> start slicker than a minor's pepper. Watch you stay up. Hold on. There's his little hole right there. I bet you I put a snare on that and we'd have rat for dinner in the morning. Probably so. Morning. Probably so. Oh my gosh! They're really quiet right now. They 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 knew we were yeah, they knew we were sitting. nearby. They were right? they were fighting hard, fighting tough. Thistle, well, you can they eat stick it. you, don't they? Well, them do, but these down here don't. And you eat that? You can eat that, just like uh, sort of like cucumber or celery. Okay. Lucky Charms, <laughs> Lucky Charms, sure. Eat or bake? We're gonna do half and half. Yep. This oven's really cool. So there's a top section, it's really small, so it heats up extremely fast. And then there's the bottom, it's bigger. So upper, bake, 350, start. And it's gonna go up like five degrees every second. It's rapid preheat. How are they, Joey? <laughs> bless him. They look super adorable, look at that. All right, here's the cookies. What do you think? Mine's really good. What's it taste like? And then marshmallow. Mm. <laughs> it's really good. See, what are you doing? You're, you're being room service? Mm -hmm. Do you think he's going to believe that you did this for him? Okay, sorry. Sorry, I'm giving it away. Let me quiet. I'm gonna burn my mouth. <laughs> Give me a little, little piece. What's it taste like? I don't know. You don't know? Cookie dough? Are you suspicious? Birthday cake. No, no. It's, it's like sugar cookie with Lucky Charms. It is Lucky Charms. That's what it is. All I, was, right. I was looking for it, I couldn't find yeah. it. What are you doing? Uh, well, I want to get everybody's advice and, and pointing the cannon up at the eclipse, but. So you're gonna break your camera? No, because the cloud cover is so thick that I've barely got a couple glimpses of it. But I bet, I mean, it, it's right here, the cloud cover is so dense that, I mean, you can look at it with the naked eye. The girls. Hmm? The girls saw it, yeah. They seen it. Yeah. And they came downstairs and they were so proud. They were like, I just seen it. Yeah, it was cool to see. She said, yep. I looked right there and there it was. And I was like, Jay, and Kiko was like, you looked at it? She goes, it was a cloud. <laughs> it was. For real, it was. Everybody, I mean, now, if, if there was no cloud cover, you she none should of us not, would be no. out there doing that. No, but, I mean, it was it, it was no different than looking at the sun behind a cloud normally, you know. It's, yeah. I don't even know if I'm going to get very good footage on the, on the cannon or not, but I got a little bit. Got a little bit. Yeah. The last moments of our stay here. This is going to be such a short vlog. That's probably what it's going to be with like daily. Let me give you a view. I did work. Like I said, I worked from home though. This is our last moments in this spot. But look at how pretty it is. And also Gatlinburg right now is a ghost town i think it was like the dollywood outsider when we were asking like is it going to be this busy at dollywood the whole time he predicted on this day that the crowds would go home because of spring break and he should be a psychic because they are lunch what about how cute they are 
having lunch. It is a work day, so I, it's a work from home day though. Um, but I just brought the computer out here. And here's how little squirrel got a day. He decided to climb all the way up here and just hang out on these twigs. And this is how far he's up there. Hi. I'm looking at this squirrel. It's his first day being a squirrel again. Look at him. Now he's right there. He's right there now, but he was on those branches. He's a ninja, isn't he? Hey. Hey. This is our last day at this cabin. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's, we've been here, what, three nights? Yeah. Yeah, it's really, really nice. I, I don't want to leave. Okay. You didn't know I was going to ask you this. No. Okay. Right off the top of your head. Yeah. Top five favorite cabins. Just oh your opinion. Gosh, why would you do this right now? Because it's right there. All right, so I want to start with outside of Heaven's Cabins. What? Uh, well, I'm just going to start. Okay. Outside, because I, I, I... So, Enchanted Forest, which was formerly Electric Forest, uh, that had the laser lights. The TP. The TP. Uh, that's on my top five. Uh, the Big Bear Shack, Big mm -hmm. Bear Shack, um, this is where Randy new, was with brand us. Brand new, where Randy was with us. When they had that. a great like mix of modern and traditional cabin vibes. Mm -hmm. So those are my two outside of. I mean, it's very easy, very easily we could put just all, all the cabins. yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, but just a just a switch splash of a variety bit. right there. Yeah. yeah. So Smoky Mountain Heaven, I think that's the name of the one with the outdoor pool mm -hmm. at Heaven's Cabins. Did uh, you say Big Bear Shack? I think that's what it's called. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah, yeah. Um, but Smoky Mountain Heaven, I think, is the name of the one with the outdoor pool. Yeah. Are you okay? I was looking for my squirrel. I don't know oh, where he's at. Uh, I'm kind of <laughs> concerned about him. He likes to climb up on the top of branches like that. And I don't know how strong these branches are. It must be pretty He's strong. stressing me out. Um, and then probably, um, man, it, you know, all these Heaven's Cabins, are they kind of blend in together. Um, but then probably Heaven's Playhouse. Is it that the one, the one with the, the pumpkin? The set, the one we carved the pumpkin. That was a cabin that I would live in. I would live in all of these, but it it just felt like home. Yeah, yeah. There. Yeah, and um, and then I'm gonna. I, I mean, I'm gonna say this is the next one on the list. Um, indoor pool. Mm -hmm. And that hot tub, that hot tub is hard. Like, it's the best hot tub I've ever been in. It's really hard to choose because, like, I like the very first Heaven's Cabins we did, too. And then I I really like all of the cabins that we've ever stayed at, even outside of Heaven's Cabins. I'd say with the exception of, like, one of our first ones. It was, like, my birthday. We stayed there. Another one that you talking about feeling like home. Another one that really felt like home was um, uh, Bigfoot. Oh, we literally just chilled. Man, look, and, and the snow came, and mm -hmm. it was just, uh, but th in the minute walking, they, they created such an inviting space at, at, at the Bigfoot Highway. Mm -hmm. uh, it was, uh, we said it uh, several times during mm -hmm. our stay that it was like, man, it feels like home here. So you see Eric's top five cabins. We have a top five cabins video for main channel coming out and see if that ends up being the final list because we do like a combination you want to get the kids input the add has kicked in okay bye